say? Yes! Great job! Come on! Let's explore the amazing world of science! I am very glad to be with you today and be part of your learning adventure in exploring the wonder of science. I am Teacher Luella and welcome to my science class in grade 4. Today, we are going to learn about the weather. But before that, here are some rules to follow when watching this video lesson. is the state of the atmosphere at a place and time as regards heat, dryness, sunshine, wind, rain, and etc. What is the correct answer? Weather is the correct answer. Blanc is the condition of being protected from or unlikely to cause danger, risk, or injury. What is the correct answer? Correct! Safety is the correct answer. Blanc is a measure taken in advance to prevent something dangerous, unpleasant, or inconvenient from happening. What is your answer? Very good! Precautions is the correct answer. 
Now, I want you to prepare the following materials that we are going to use for our activities as we go along the lesson. Manila paper, pencil pen, bond paper, notebook, and ball pen. I will be showing a picture on your screen. Using your manila paper and pencil pen, I want you to write some activities that you are going to do that keep you safe during this kind of weather. Now, the first picture is... Have you listed down your answer? How about this type of weather? Kindly jot down your answer. What about the last picture? Are you done? Now, let us check your answer. On a sunny day, we eat cold foods, we do not expose our skin to extreme heat of the sun, and we wear light clothes, and we should not burn dried leaves. On a rainy day, it is important to wear thick clothes, eat warm foods, and prepare Ziplocs, dry socks, and other waterproof cover for our things. Do not play under the rain and use raincoat and umbrella. On a windy day, we should close our doors and windows. We wear thick loads. We move to the middle of our home or basement away from windows and glass doors. And we should be careful with fire. Wow! You did it! Great job! Now, let's proceed to our next activity. I will give you a different situation related to safety precaution during sunny day, rain day, and windy day. Using your band paper and ball pen, you write what will happen to the person involved in the situation. Game, let's start. Situation number one. Angelica enjoyed sunbathing without applying sunblock cream all over her face and body. What will happen to Angelica? Correct. Angelica will get a sunburn that can cause skin irritation. Situation number two. Alex and Vince are playing at the plaza while it is raining. What will happen to Alex and Vince? Yes, they will catch a cold and got sick. So do not play under the rain. Situation number three. One afternoon, Rolando climbed up on a tree while a strong wind was blowing. What do you think will happen to Rolando? Oh, poor Rolando. He fell off the ground. So better stay inside the house when strong winds are blowing. Look at the pictures shown on your screen. Identify each picture whether it shows safety precaution or not during sunny day, rainy day, and windy day. Get a sheet of paper and number your papers 1 to 4. Put check mark on a picture showing safety precaution and X mark for the picture that do not show safety precaution. Let's start. For picture number 1, yes, a check mark. Per the second picture, it's an X mark. How about the third picture? Right, still an X mark. And the fourth picture? Very good. The answer is a check mark. Well done, kids. We need to know weather condition to keep us safe. Knowledge on the weather forecast for the day also help us make necessary precautions. Now, tell me the things that we should do 
and not to do during sunny days, rainy days, and winter days. On sunny days, it is important to wear light clothes, eat cold foods, and not to expose our skin to extreme heat of the sun. And we should not burn dried leaves. During rainy days, it is important to wear thick clothes and eat warm foods, prepare ziplocks, dry socks, and other waterproof covers for our things. We should not play in the rain to avoid colds. And it is also a must to use raincoat and umbrella. On winter days, do not forget to close your doors and windows. Wear thick loads, move to the middle of your home or basement away from windows and glass doors. And we should be careful with fire. Why is it important to know weather condition? You're right. So we will be able to know the things that we need to prepare to avoid accident. Then what happened if we did not follow safety precaution during different weather condition? That's right. We can be put all to danger if we do not follow safety precaution during the different weather condition. This time, let us apply our knowledge about identifying safety precaution during sunny day, rainy day, and win today. I will present a series of incomplete sentences. And in your notebook, you write sunny day, rain day, and win day to complete the sentence. You will be given five seconds in each question. Are you ready? Let us begin. One, on Blanc. It is important to use raincoat and umbrella. Correct. Rainy day. Number two, we should apply sunblock cream if we go to the beach for swimming on Blanc. That is right. Sun day. Number three, we should be very careful with fire on Blanc. That's right. Wind day. Number four, it is important to eat warm food on Blanc. Correct, rainy day. Number five, on Blanc, we should close our doors and windows. Correct, winter day. Great. So why is it important to take good care of our own self? Check. It is important to take good care of our own self so we can live longer and can do all the things we want in the future. Great job! What is your score? I know you did great in the activity. Today, we all learned how to identify safety precautions and different weather conditions. So always remember the things to do and not to do during sunny day rainy day and winter day and let us apply what we have learned today in our daily activities i hope you learn a lot and enjoy our discussion today once again this is teacher loella reminding you that our own safety should always be our first priority therefore embrace the new normal see you next time